Hi there. Struggling with messy paperwork? Slowing down your business? Not anymore. Document automation is game changer for you. So you must be wondering what is document automation? Document automation is intelligent document processing that's called IDP solution from the vendor automation anywhere. It leverages OCR, which is optical character recognition, AI, human, and automation technologies to automate your end-to-end -end document processing. Now you must be thinking why only DA? Why only document automation? So it transforms how businesses handle documents, extracting data faster, reducing errors and boosting productivity. On top of that, it comes with a unified Automation Anywhere platform, which helps you to create bots, software robots, uh, interacting with this IDP solution, human in the loop and AI technologies at one place. So it's available as part of a complete unified platform within A360, Automation Anywhere's A360 platform. You might be aware or you might have heard about uh, these solutions which extract information. Earlier, people used to use OCR technologies, right? Now, while working with structured documents, it's comparatively easy because you know the structure of the document, you can define the areas from where the data needs to be extracted. But the problem or the challenges come when we extract data from semi-structured or unstructured documents. But this is no more a problem now. With document automations, integration with Gen AI or generative AI, this is quite possible. And we'll see that what are the options available for you to extract information from these kind of semi-structured or unstructured documents. So generative AI is everywhere as there would be no one in working into tech or non-tech that they are not aware about generative AI. Thanks to ChatGPT for that. The tight integration between DA, document automation and Gen AI allows us to extract data from structured, semi-structured and unstructured documents. So all the three kind of documents. The common use cases could be uh, reading data from contracts because there, there is no standard for contracts, financial uh, statements, uh, emails, CVs or resumes, uh, lease agreements and many more. Let me take you to my screen and show you how to create a learning instance for reading data from unstructured documents and what are the options available within the Automation Anywhere platform. I'm logged into Automation Anywhere's control room. Then we'll go here under AI heading document automation. So once you go to document automation, you'll see all the learning instances that are available in the system, which were already created. I'll show you how to create a new one using Gen AI feature. So click on create learning instance. You'll get a pop-up to name your learning instance. So I'll give, give it uh, this name, but you can give it a more meaningful name related to your process. Then description is optional and the, then we get a pre-trained templates here. So if you are want to extract data from invoice, bill of lading, packing list, stand forms, these are utility bills. These are some of the predefined document types. But in our case, we are dealing with now unstructured document. Gen AI feature can be used across all the format of the documents, whether it's standard, semi-structured or unstructured. But it is mainly used for uh, best fitted to use for unstructured documents. So let me select unstructured document. As soon as you select unstructured document type, You'll, you'll get this option which is checked by default and grayed out. You cannot unselect it because that is the only option to extract data from unstructured documents. Let me change the document type here and I'll show you the difference. If I change the document type, you can see here, you get an option to whether use or not use Gen AI driven data extraction. You can uncheck this. In that case, it will not use Gen AI for your extraction and you can choose from Anthropic or OpenAI and the OCR provider is AB. There are also two options available, AB or Google Vision. This is how you create a learning instance. Once you click on next, it will ask you to define the fields which you want to extract. So there are two fields, form field as well as table fields. Form fields are one where data is not repeated. Table field is something which uh, the data uh, is in a table format and it's repeatable. The rows are repeating basically. So I'm not going to create this learning instance now. Uh, you just The intent was to just show how to create a learning instance. Uh, I'll show you one of the learning instance that is leveraging Gen AI along with document automation. So this instance is uh, using document type as unstructured document. I'll click here. And as you can see, there are a few form fields as well as few table fields. So once I click on this table field, you can see here, there's an option search query for Gen AI model. 
so here if i click here what is the date they have they have given this query to the generative ai model and then model what the model will do model will search uh, parse the entire document and search for the date from the document and it will extract the date in this format as we have specified it to use this format similarly for batch number extract all batch volumes from the following text this is the prompt that has been given it will search the entire document and try to extract the batch number and fit in feed in to this field name similarly you can use these queries these prompts for your table fields as well in this learning instance they have not used because they might have not felt the need to do so um, similarly they are extracting sku number from the prompt as well and they have specified extract all the unique material code value from the text ensure to remove duplicates and return the values as hash separated like it, it helps you to do a data validation also to a certain extent and to remove unwanted characters from whatever information that you're extracting so that's all about document automation with gen ai thank you